The early days, from BASIC to Microsoft. Bill Gates was fascinated by computers from a young age. He spent countless hours writing code on a teletype machine. This passion led him to meet Paul Allen. In 1975, they co-founded Microsoft. Their first creation was BASIC for the Altair 8800. The early days were marked by long hours and intense coding. Gates pushed his team to innovate and improve. The Altair BASIC project was pivotal for Microsoft. It established Microsoft as a key player in the software industry. They secured a crucial licensing deal with MITS. Gates and his team adapted and innovated tirelessly. Successes like MS-DOS cemented Microsoft's leading position. In 1980, a pivotal opportunity presented itself. IBM, the dominant force in the computer industry, approached Microsoft to develop an operating system for their upcoming personal computer. This deal would prove to be a watershed moment, not just for Microsoft, but for the entire trajectory of the personal computer industry. Gates, recognizing the magnitude of this opportunity, seized it with both hands. While Microsoft didn't have its own fully developed operating system at the time, Gates astutely secured the rights to a system called 86DOS from Seattle Computer Products. They adapted and refined it, renaming it MS-DOS, and licensed it to IBM for their new PC. The IBM PC was a resounding success, and with it, Mississippi, DOS, became the de facto standard for personal computers. This deal catapulted Microsoft to the forefront of the software industry, establishing them as a key partner to hardware manufacturers worldwide. Gates's strategic brilliance in securing and leveraging the IBM deal was a masterstroke that would shape the future of computing. With MS-DOS as its flagship product, Microsoft embarked on an era of unprecedented growth and expansion. Gates's vision extended beyond simply licensing software. He aimed to create an ecosystem of products that would meet the evolving needs of businesses and individuals, embracing the power of personal computing. Microsoft released a suite of applications to complement MS-DOS, including Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, laying the foundation for what would become the ubiquitous Microsoft Office suite. Gates understood that software was more than just code. It was a tool that could empower people to be more productive, creative, and connected. As the 1980s progressed, Microsoft's influence on the tech industry grew exponentially. Gates, with his relentless drive and uncompromising approach to quality, built a company that was as admired as it was feared. He became a global icon, symbolizing the rise of the personal computer and the transformative power of software. Section 5 Going Public, the IPO that minted a billionaire. On March 13, 1986, Microsoft took a giant leap forward by launching its initial public offering. The IPO was a resounding success, raising $61 million and valuing the company at a staggering $775 million. Gates, who owned 45% of Microsoft's shares, became a multimillionaire overnight, his net worth soaring to an estimated $350 million. However, the true impact of the IPO went far beyond the immediate financial gains. It marked Microsoft's transition from a successful startup to a publicly traded corporation, subject to greater scrutiny and held to higher standards of accountability. For Gates, it meant stepping into the limelight as the public face of one of the world's most innovative and rapidly growing companies. The IPO also created a new generation of millionaires among Microsoft's early employees, many of whom had shared Gates's vision and dedication during the company's formative years. This shared success further solidified the loyalty and commitment within Microsoft, fueling its continued growth and innovation. Section 6, The Visionary Leader, Gates' Impact on Microsoft's Success. Bill Gates' leadership was central to Microsoft's phenomenal success. He possessed a rare combination of technical brilliance, business acumen, and an almost uncanny ability to anticipate future trends in the tech industry. He was deeply involved in every aspect of the business, from product development to marketing strategies, driving his team to achieve ambitious goals. Gates's management style was demanding, often described as intense and confrontational. He was not afraid to challenge his employees, pushing them to think outside the box and deliver exceptional results. However, this demanding nature was balanced by a deep respect for talent and a willingness to listen to different perspectives. 
His leadership extended beyond the walls of Microsoft. Gates became a vocal advocate for the transformative power of technology, arguing that computers had the potential to revolutionize education, healthcare, and countless other aspects of society. His vision and passion inspired a generation of entrepreneurs and technologists, shaping the digital landscape we know today. Section 7. The Microsoft Legacy – Shaping the Future of Technology Under Gates' leadership, Microsoft played a pivotal role in bringing personal computers into homes and businesses worldwide. MS-DOS and its successor, Windows, became the dominant operating systems, powering millions of computers globally. Microsoft's applications such as Word, Excel, and PowerPoint became essential tools for businesses of all sizes, transforming the way we work and communicate. Beyond its core software products, Microsoft ventured into new territories, developing web browsers, gaming consoles, and cloud computing platforms. Gates' relentless pursuit of innovation ensured that Microsoft remained at the forefront of the tech industry, constantly evolving to meet the changing needs of consumers and businesses alike. Microsoft's impact on the technology landscape is undeniable. The company's products and services have touched the lives of billions of people, transforming how we learn, work, play, and connect. Gates's legacy as a tech visionary and business leader continues to inspire generations of entrepreneurs and innovators worldwide. Section 8, Beyond Microsoft Gates' Enduring Influence. Bill Gates stepped down from his day-to-day -day role at Microsoft in 2000, but his influence extended far beyond the company. Through the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, he has tackled global health, poverty, and education. Gates's philanthropic work has had a profound impact on countless lives. The Gates Foundation has played a crucial role in eradicating polio and combating malaria. Gates's commitment to making a positive difference has earned him widespread admiration. His journey from a computer enthusiast to a tech titan and philanthropist is extraordinary. His legacy extends far beyond the lines of code he wrote or the wealth he amassed. 